Yeah, I, I suppose I felt sorry for the player and the individual himself, you know. I suppose on the field, you know, there's an awful lot of people talking about, you know, making the right call, making the right decision, making the right pass. And sometimes off the field, you have to do the same thing, you know. And there's only a week between the two games. And I suppose he's after making a little mistake, you know. And as I said a while ago, it's an amateur sport. And, you know, it's, you know, this particular player, you know, it's, he's somebody's son. He could be somebody's partner. And, you know, he's to deal with this now in his own little way as well now in his, his own mental health and whatever disciplinary, disciplinary action is going to come from that. So, you know, I, I, I hope it ends okay for him. Feel sorry for him. And, you know, just in the wrong place at the wrong time, basically, especially when there's only a week uh, of a gap of a match. And if it was this Sunday night, you, you probably have three weeks of a gap for a month of the final. And, you know, they could have went someplace nice and quiet, don't have a chat between themselves. But, you know, Bang smack in the middle of the championship, you know. He obviously knows this himself. He's after his, his judgment, you know, probably made the wrong call, you know. So I, my, my heart was out for him, being honest. Do you, Kieran? do you see um, just with, with John Kiley and like there was maybe some outside noise coming in before the Tipperary game? This is probably something that no one, no manager wants to deal with. It's something that they've, they've tried to nip in the bud now. Do you see it becoming a bigger problem or an issue uh, that might, you know, reflect in their on-field performances or anything like that over the coming months? No, I, I wouldn't think so. I think they're a lot more mature and professional to that. Actually, if anything, if anything, it, it'll actually galvanise the spirit and the atmosphere between the squad, actually. I, I would feel that probably, from the outside looking in, it might look as a very negative thing. But I'd imagine in that army of the Limerick squad and the management team, if anything, it'll probably make them that bit tighter and it'll probably crank it up another few notches. I'm just wondering, Kieran. um, like during your own playing days, and I throw this to you, Richie, as well. Um, did you ever find yourself in a like a, not a, you know not that type of a situation necessarily, but you know a sticky situation, or you know people maybe even trying to go on a night out or anything like that? Was that was that ever the case? Because it's almost like intercounty players are front and center on TV and with different things, and people people like to maybe say maybe pass a comment to them or try to maybe go them into a reaction or something like that was that ever something Kieran, that you were kind of a subject to throughout your own career well i was thinking there you know if social media was around in my time i'd be a star on it every week <laughs> 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 so thank thank god if i wasn't there you know yeah and i suppose to answer your question yeah you you will always come across somebody you know because you know, and 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 they'll be testing you, and I suppose that's why it's so important. You know, wherever one goes, that you're in good company, you're with solid people, and uh, you know they can spot it quicker before anything can happen. And you know, unfortunately, we've no control whatsoever uh, wherever we go, who we meet, or what they say. But we have control in around our reply and kind of removing our, removing ourselves from as what I would call unwanted noise. So you would have a certain amount of it that would try to. Uh, have an old cut off Kieran Carey or there's Richie Old Power there in the corner and we'll see what he's made of. And this is kind of this is a kind of a macho image. And I suppose that depends where you go. You know, and if you're going really to the solid places, you won't, but it depends where you go. And that comes back then to making the right call, the right choice, the right decision, and with the right people around you. See the full video only at patreon.com forward slash our game.